Harry and Meghan, the Duke and Duchess of Sussex, have been accused of stealing the words of Nelson Mandela in order to make money for themselves. Indileka Mandela, the granddaughter of the late South African president and anti-apartheid icon, made the accusation in relation to the Sussex's Netflix documentary, Live to Lead. In the documentary, Harry quotes Mandela as saying, What counts in life is not the mere fact that we've lived. Meghan then appears on screen to complete the quote with, It is what difference we have made to the lives of others that will determine the significance of the life we lead. Indileka Mandela stated that she is upset and troubled by the comparison of the Sussex's issues with the royal family to her grandfather's fight for freedom. She told the Australian, that's chalk and cheese, there is no comparison. I know the Nelson Mandela Foundation has supported the initiative, but people have stolen grandfather's quotes for years and have used his legacy because they know his name sells. Harry and Meghan are no different from them. Despite her upset, Indileka Mandela did express admiration for Harry's decision to break away from the royal family. She said, I admire Harry for having the confidence to break away from an institution as iconic as the royal family. Grandad rebelled against an arranged marriage to find his own path in life. But it comes at a price, you have to then fund your own life, I've made peace with people using Grandad's name but it's still deeply upsetting and tedious every time it happens. The Sussexes documentary is part of a $100 million deal with Netflix and was released shortly after the Harry and Meghan documentary. In addition, Harry's memoir, called Spare, is set to be released on January 10. The book is described by publisher Penguin Random House as his story at last and a landmark publication full of insight, revelation, self-examination, and hard-won wisdom about the eternal power of love over grief. The proceeds from the book will be donated to British charities. In a statement, the Nelson Mandela Foundation said, The foundation has a licensing agreement with the Duke and Duchess for the use of President Mandela's words in their Netflix documentary and accompanying book. We believe their use of the President's words is in line with his values and the efforts he made to promote human rights and equality for all. It is not the first time that Harry and Meghan have faced controversy regarding their use of quotes. In their 2018 wedding ceremony, they included a quote from Martin Luther King Jr., which prompted backlash from some who felt it was inappropriate to use the quote out of context. Harry and Meghan have also faced criticism for their expensive lifestyle and for their multi-million dollar deals with streaming platforms Netflix 